All right, ladies and gentlemen. Was reading some of that wrestling news. Some very interesting wrestling news there. <sighs> Neville released from his WWE contract or whatever. Apparently this is breaking news. It's been ongoing for a year and a half there. Um, I don't really remember why he left. I don't know if he explained why he left. I don't know if it's a CM Punk thing that... He wasn't happy with his place on the card there. The guy was good, you know what I mean, but the man weighed about 50 pounds, ladies and gentlemen. Looked like a goddamn gremlin, you know what I mean. Um, I think his place on the card was pretty good, especially for a guy that looks like a mutant, you know what I mean. He was the star of 205 Live there. Featured on Raw every week. He had pay-per-view matches every month with the Cruiserweight title. That's good enough for a guy the size of a squirrel, you know what I mean? What did, what did he expect there? To, to become the next Stone Cold Steve Austin? The man looks like he was beat in the face by a shovel, ladies and gentlemen. Clearly can't become a world champion when he looks like that, but... He still had respect from the company, and then he quit, ladies and gentlemen. He had the wild on the silver platter, and he quit like a jackass quitter. That's what happened there. But of course, the indie fanboys, the mongoloids, they're going to see this as something heroic. Something noble because he left McMahon to go work for pennies on the dollar, ladies and gentlemen. He's going to have to to do what? To go live in Japan there to make a quarter of his paycheck. Has to go live in some weirdo country full of weird Japanese freaks there. Is that is that noble there? He's going to show McMahon. He showed you, McMahon. Showed him what? That he's working for a tenth of his money. He's going to show McMahon that he's bad at mathematics. That he doesn't know a good thing when it's right there in his face. He's going to show McMahon that he's a jackass or whatever. You know, good for him. He might become Ring of Honor champion, but that belt isn't worth five bucks. You know what I mean? A fucking midget federation, ladies and gentlemen. Dave Metzer is going to give him four and a half stars or something like this. And somehow this is going to prove something to McMahon, though. It's going to prove that Neville is a jackass and he's a quitter, ladies and gentlemen. That's what it's going to prove. It's like leaving Major League Baseball to go work for some house league somewhere with retards there. Is that how you prove that you're good there? Fuck that there. It proves that he's a fucking moron is what it proves people there. He was good, but not that good there. It's another Austin Aries, a schmuck who thinks he deserves everything even though he doesn't. Fuck this, ladies and gentlemen. Until next time. Peace! The fuck is that noise? <laughs>